pussy with this guy. Well. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> it's like one of my favorite things in this game is that guy. Hey guys, welcome back to the next Vegetunes. Uh, we are playing Link to the Past again, and I don't remember where to go. <laughs> All right, press the uh, find your map. It'll tell you where to go. Um, map so right now is, you're still looking. How do I? Uh, it's a dedicated button. I believe it's Y. Uh, X y. Or y. No. Y was arrow. X. X there you press X again. All right, so you need okay. to go to the bottom left. Why can't I go to the top middle or top left? Uh, top left is the Master Sword, and you you have to have all three pendants to collect it. Uh, oh. And the top middle, you are just you can't get there with your current items. Okay, so I need to go down to the bridge, and then I can just make my way across. Okay. Um, it, it, in, the, in the theme oh, uh, of a... Huh? Hold down the B button. B is the bottom one. Uh... Hold down the A button, sorry. Oh, okay. That was what you got from Zahara so all about. I mean, that's kind of cool, I guess. That's very good. That's uh, I need to go this way. Hey, it hurts them. Cool. Mm -hmm. Yep, you do You do uh, put your sword out front. You you can still, like, if you run into them without their... Because your sword uh, has a hitbox. Uh, it's, just not the, it's not just the area in front of you. Come here. And you do have the bow as well. I, I want to sword him. Fine. Oh, I'm not going to get his... I don't think he dropped anything, but... Nope. <laughs> and they respawn. Uh, in in the theme of Zelda, uh, I had... You know, I've been playing a lot of uh, Tears of the Kingdom. Mm -hmm. Likewise. And I had some talking points. Keep heading south. Yeah. Ooh, I did not expect that to happen. Um, I should have done that a long time ago. Let's go... Mow the grass, mow the grass. Nice. What's in here? Can I get in there? Yeah. Is this going to be something that's going to come up later? Ooh. Uh, I can only push it, right? Mm -hmm. But if you leave, it'll reset it. Well, let me think. So if you get it wrong. Oh, I, I understand. I understand. If I can push it. And then put that aside. Yay. Easy. Oh. Bum. Boom. I didn't even read it. Oh, well. Um. So said so you can pick up the bomb you placed by pressing A. Yeah. And go back in there. Oh, to go behind it? Yep. Um, I will push that, and I'll push that, and I will go in. And... What, what are you supposed to do with yeah, those? Yeah, you got it. They're levers, so you can pull them. Do you hold A? There you go. You figured it out. Uh, ah! <laughs> I guess I gotta go... Right first? No, nope, you just not. have to open No, it's just going to automatically right do it. Yeah, you just had to open the correct one. Well, cool. What is this going to do? It's, it's going to fill, fill water up in the map. A hey, heart. Piece of heart. Cool, cool. Um, you can pick the, up the fish if you wanted to. You just run up to it? Uh, yeah, there you go. Oh, I don't get to save in my inventory? No. But if you take it back Meh. to the, the shopkeeper guy, he'll give you like 30 rupees and some bombs and stuff for it. Okay, I'm going the right uh, way. You'll need to go north, actually. Why? Because you, you have to get an item with the boots that you have now before you can go get the pendant. See, this this is what I didn't like about Link to the Past the first time I played it. <laughs> is Because I would just go. There's nothing that told me I needed to go get the right boots. Mm -hmm. um, and I'm only telling you for the sake of time. Right. So it's not a 60-hour game. Can I not get out of here? Uh, you can keep going right. Oh, I can uh, just walk the, through the water? Yeah, the shallow water. The light-colored water is shallows. Yeah. Uh, you will eventually get the boots, but you need like 500 rupees to get that. So you can get it at any point now. Like, you'd get the boots now if you want the, uh, the uh, fins. I'm... If you wanted to, but you don't have enough money for them. Yeah. Drop a heart. Well, cut down the bushes. See if there's hearts. Um, so complaints about Tears of the Kingdom. Right. Uh, Champion stop. I, 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 I'm. What the heck? 
You can rewind. What happened? So uh, sometimes there's a uh, there's a mine in the in the grass. Okay, well, I'm not gonna hit that one. You can also just use the boots to uh, dash through all the stuff. But I'm hoping for a heart. Yeah, it'll it'll still drop behind you. Oh yeah, that makes sense. And I think there's hearts in that in Link's house there. If I remember um, correctly. In the pot, under the pots. I mostly have small complaints. Mm -hmm. Um. But the big one is the companion system. The companion yeah, system. I cannot overstate how much I loathe the companion system in combat. Um, mm -hmm. I hate how. Where, where do I need to go first uh, of all? Keep going left. You'll need, to go, you'll need to go to these buildings right there. Okay. Um, I despise how you have to run up to your companion and interact with them in order to use their ability in mm -hmm. the middle of combat. Yep. Um, and they, those companions are not in a guaranteed to even be there. They're running around doing their own yeah, thing. Yeah, they're the running around fighting fighting the boss. Like, the the for me, it was the worst when I was fighting the queen boss. Okay, actually, I'm going to put a timestamp here for for uh, if you, if you want to skip go in the any tears. Go in the house to the right. The if you want to skip Tears of the Kingdom spoilers, go to this timestamp I'm about to put up. <laughs> um Nope, not that way. Uh, that's a good way to get money if, with the rewind function, though. Oh, okay. Because you can cheat. Because it's a, uh, it's a, it's a random uh, order. Yeah. Or something. Yeah, it's like uh, one of these. Ch uh, I believe you can sprint into that wall. I don't, I don't think you have to use bombs. I think you can sprint do, into. Oh, it. now I use the uh, Y button. Yay. Um. When I was fighting the queen boss in the lightning temple, mm -hmm. Queen Gibdo, uh, I was trying to get my. Was this what I was supposed to do? Uh, not to get the item, but you can do that. That'll get you a heart piece. Uh, okay. Well, how do I get the heart piece? Talk to her. If you can reach the goal within fifteen seconds, we'll give you something good. Where's the goal? So the goal is through this little maze and over on the left. So you'll want to dash through. Nope. Well, I don't think you I'm going to Go ahead and get, get the path, and then we can just try it again. This way? Yep. Uh, nope, never mind. I sent you... I, I led you astray. You got to go along the top part. So, so my goal is to get to the guy with the blue hair? Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay, I see it. That's going to be... That's going to be some running. <laughs> Let's try it again. Yeah, you'll have to get back to our other side. Yeah, there we go. Go in, come back out. Um, Tears of the Kingdom. Uh, yep, yep, yep. Oh, I'm hitting. Come on. Go, good to do the. You might want to use the D-pad, by the way. That's not the issue. It's hitting <laughs> the A button. I don't think I'm going to get it. I'm sure it's been. Only two seconds off. All right, well, I'll try again. Uh, Say just suck. Huh? The sages suck. Yeah. Uh, Especially when, when I was like, fighting the me, queen, I kept trying to get to the. I kept trying to get my Goron guy to, to do the fireball roll. Right. Uh, and I'm chasing him because he's chasing her to do damage to her. And I'm like screaming at my TV. I'm like, get back. You like just. I hate it. I hate it mm -hmm. so much. Especially since it's like so unnecessary because like they could have they could have done it like they did with Breath of the Wild where it's. Just a a button prompt. Woo! Yay, Eli! Then you fall off, me, and then you have to do it again. Um, um I you, you can just jump down. You don't have to go back this way. Well, don't I need to go into the house to do the item yeah, you were talking about? But the other the other just jumping down would have got you back to the same spot anyway. Um, but yeah, and then where do I need to go? Go not this house, the other one next to it, the small one. Um. Which Queen the Queen Gibdo, like I was that was one of the most interesting boss fights to me of all of them. Uh I did not like Colgara. I thought it was a very boring boss. Uh this one? Yeah. Nope, not that one. Dang it. What which room was it? Go back to this pull up your map. Uh I think it's that one. Oh, okay. I know it's one of one of the houses here in town. Um You'll need to go north. By the way, not not. not oh, it can't way. do it that way. No, um, unless you want to loop all the way around the map. Oh gosh, this is gonna be a. This is gonna be. <laughs> you got the sprint button. Actually, it might be there. Yeah, it's there. 
Um, I feel like they should, excuse me, do it to where, how do I get that book? Oh, I know how. I think I know. Yay. Was this the item you were talking about? Yep, that's the one. You found a book of M Mudora. You can use it to read the ancient language of, Hi okay. Which we now know, know to actually be the ancient language of the Zonai. That's not. Because we retconned that. That's not canon yet. <laughs> um, I can't jump down there. Oh, that's that's above me. I see. I see the problem. Uh, whoops, wrong button. Yeah, so yeah I have can, to go all the way back to where I was. Yeah, now you can go back down to the pendant. Okay. Um, what I think they should do is you hold down the down button, which is whistle for the horse, but if you hold it down, it could pull up like a wheel that you could choose your companion ability from. Mm-hmm. Um, that's my big complaint is is how f just frustrating they are in combat. The, you could also like there's so many like for Riju like her art electricity thing. Just while you're aiming down, like while you've got a, a, an arrow drawn, you press mm -hmm. A and that would activate it. Yeah. Or you know while you've got your shield uh, out, get around him. you press a button to fire off Yunobo, uh, the Goron, um, the Zora. I don't know. Maybe just do what you do for uh, Rivali's Gale in Breath of the Wild, where you just jump and hold it. I don't know, but there's just there's so there's so many easy ways to do it, and the the system they implemented is just not good. Is it this way? Yeah. Um, my second complaint, which is a pretty small one, I want to see what this guy. Well. <laughs> 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 uh, uh, <laughs> I just, uh, it's like one of my favorite things in this game is that guy because he does serve a purpose in the game but he's completely optional uh, go up I believe that cave Kay. has a fairy yeah which these fairies are considerably less terrifying than you know Ocarina or Majora's Mask less, less horny for sure yeah oh that oh that's enough. Definitely, the fairies in Tears of the Kingdom and Breath of the Wild are thirsty. Yeah, major thirsty. Um, and it's a good thing it fades to black whenever you upgrade your your stuff. Come at me! Come at me! Um, I like well, the octopus uh, in the sand. It looks like a tick. <laughs> I know he's gonna like. You've got a boomerang. Yeah, it's true. Uh, ha ha! Oh, <laughs> oh, and then I have to get close enough to. That makes sense. Oh, we well, actually, okay. That's the mine. Oh, uh, okay. Oh. Um, well, I need to look and see where I'm going. Okay. Uh, my other complaint. But if you go up to the right, there's a another heart piece here. In the cave? I think it's in a cave. My other complaint is there aren't really any consequences to discovering something. Um, the the fir the only example I really have is when I... Well, let's see what this guy says. Aha! Uh -huh, here's the book of Mudora. With it, you can read the language of the Hylia people. <laughs> Which is exactly what the book of Mudora told us. But That's you can it. blow up that wall at the bottom. That was a useless encounter. Um, so I did the uh, the the tear memory, which showed, in spoiler, showed that there was a there was an imposter Zelda. Mm -hmm. So I knew that for for days, and I was like, oh, okay, so this Zelda we've been seeing at every regional uh, phenomenon phenomenon. Is obviously the imposter. It's, it's the bad guy Zelda, and the Zelda that's in the uh, Hyrule Castle is bad news. That's not the real Zelda. Mm -hmm. I knew that for a long time, and I feel like Link should know that because Link saw the same memory I did. Mm -hmm. And yet, when you go to Hyrule Castle and and have that uh, confrontation in the cutscene, it's like, oh, I have never been Zelda this whole time, and and Link's I like, you. Link's like, huh? Yeah. I'm like, there's no way that they could have like, ah, that was a terrible throw. There's no way they could have, like, 
Bethesda has some faults, but for all its faults, it still accounts for like, oh, if you discover this major, I am doing terrible. <laughs> if you discover this major story thing before we plan for you to find it, there's still like a contingency for that. You know, right. there's going to be a dialogue branch that well, accounts for freaking, that. Freaking sages. All Wait, does this, this not let me read the? You gotta have use the book. Oh. The sages all have the same freaking. To open the way forward, make your wish here, and it will be granted. All have the same the freaking cutscene. Yeah, that's another thing. Like again, no consequences. Like it should be they've got four cutscenes depending on who you go to first. Right. Well, or and just then show it four cutscenes from that sage's point of view. Show me what happened. Yeah, it's just it's always the same thing. Like, ooh, there there was a time when we fought the demon king, and there were six of us and then that's, Raru sacrificed himself. And that's all I can tell you about the imprisoning war. And that must have been the imprisoning war. It's like, yeah, we know it's yeah. the imprisoning war. We were there. So, yeah. It, Nintendo dropped the ball on that one. Yeah, there, it, it's a small complaint, but it is a complaint nonetheless that there are no consequences to discovering something. Right. Um, and it's also like, there's so much in the, in the like, I love the game. It is a pure and utter joy to play. It's, oh, those wow. things are invincible. Oh, okay. Well, um, never mind. Yeah. Uh, I would give it a nine and a half out of ten. I would give it probably a nine point eight. Okay. Well, still, like, not right. a perfect ten. Not, not a but perfect ten. Very for sure. good. Now, this game, Link to the Past, absolutely, I would give it a perfect. There's 10. no hearts in any. Why won't it pick up? There we go. Because it's a dungeon, my guy. There aren't any hearts at all. I need some hearts. <laughs> Oh, how did that not? It was still coming out of its hole. Still coming out of its hole. All right, let's try it again. That was just miss. Then no, I missed. Yeah, missed. All right, so this is a dungeon. So I need to actually like pay attention play, to what I'm play doing. Play the game. Uh, but yeah, I, like I'll, I'm, I'm thinking about doing just like a two-minute review of the game, just for the channel. Uh, just doing like a, because uh, I, I feel like. You know, Tears of the Kingdom Oops. in 60 seconds is just not going to be enough time. But the dungeons are very disappointing to me. What is that thing? The lightning one was fun. Oh, they were fun, but they were too small. They're itty bitty little things. Like, I want more. I want I want something that's difficult and actually, you know, like, because they're fun, sure, but they're not hard. I kind of liked the... Uh, I didn't have any difficulty beating them in less than, like, 20 minutes. I liked the... Uh, Goron one because it, it was a lot of minecart stuff and minecart stuff is fun. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I should have gone out there. Nope. Yeah, I I, I like the dungeons, but I, they did, they didn't feel like full scale dungeons. Please move. No. What's the point of this room? Uh, red herring. Cool. Oh my gosh, <laughs> that was unfair. Can't go in there. Hearts? So I've, I've got a couple grievances with the ha, game, ha. but at the end of the day, the game is just so much fun to play. Yeah, it even doing stupid stuff like um, I spent a good hour in my last playthrough, like just going through the IG, <sighs> going through the IGN list of all the recipes and just <laughs> trying to unlock them all. Mm hmm. Okay, cool. I'm, oh, there is an arrow count. I didn't even see that. Yep. Uh, ooh, <laughs> ooh. Come on, Just going buddy. Call the recipes. Yeah, I get that. Yeah. I, I do like that they 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 made the recipes easier to like track. In tiers. kind of, they're um, still. N I wish they were on the compend compendium. Yeah, I get that. I also just wish that it didn't take so freaking long to make things. Oh, another one of my big complaints. Not, or it's not really all that big, and it's not exclu. It can shoot through walls, yeah. and it's definitely not exclusive to Tears of the Kingdom. This is really any Nintendo game ever. I shouldn't have done that. Is how how much just like unskippable stuff they have. Like, I don't need to see. Riju and Sonya, or Raru and Sonya, tell me that the light will cleanse the evil within me at the end of every single shrine. Right. It One shrine is enough. Um, it's the same with cooking. Like, why do I need to go through the cooking animation every time? I know mm -hmm. I can skip it, but that, still, that's like... That's a button, just so you know. Yeah, I know. I'm just... 
clearing all these. I know it is skippable, but it still takes like three seconds even when you skip it. Yeah, and then it has the, like, I don't need the item description every time I get one of the the shrine thingies, the whatever they're called, the in, the light bulbs. I, uh... What was the other one that I really hated? Uh, similar, similar to what you said. Uh, why am I drawing a blank? Uh, I don't remember. It, but it's some, something about just the unskippable stuff that we do all the time. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, it was um, the Great Fairy Fountain. Like yes. going through the animation of the blowy the kissy like I, especially when you're doing like four or five suit sets at a time yeah i wish i could just mass select a whole bunch of them uh the dyes i wish dying like dying clothing was easier but that's just that is a common nintendo thing is yeah. to just have unskippable just pads the game which the uh did you see the nintendo direct the most recent one no i watched uh, about 20 minutes of the... Uh, it was, I think I have to wait for it to look right at me. No, you can't kill it. Well, then how do I open... I just gotta find a button. Yep. I watched about 20 minutes of the Starfield Direct mm -hmm. and was almost in tears because I just... I cannot contain my excitement for this game. <laughs> it looks like everything I wanted in an open world space game. Yes. Like, it... I love Elite Dangerous. I don't play it that much because... You don't have the key. It yet. gets repetitive. Oh, then why am I in here? Um, but it looks like all the best parts of Elite Dangerous, mm -hmm. plus a whole lot more. I had to stop watching it because I was like, there's just too much stuff. From Have I been in here? Yes. Uh, there's wait, actually, wait, no, I don't think you've been in that one. There's way... Yeah, I didn't think so. There's way too much stuff for me to get excited about in, in that uh, direct. Oh, I know what I need to do. I know what I need to do, Zach. Don't tell me. <laughs> You just did it, so. I don't need to talk to yeah, that. Starfield, yeah, Starfield looks incredible, and I'm really excited, glad that I'm on. That's a small key. You can't open the big chest with it. Uh, uh, oh, this opens that door, probably. There you go. Uh, Starfield, I'm super ex excited for. Um, but the Nintendo Direct, they announced a new Mario game called uh, uh, Super Mario Wonder. Um, huh. And it looks. Kind of like Odyssey? Like that, that it's a 2D side scroller, oh. um, but it's a completely new art style, completely unique art style from oh, any of the other terrible. ones. Uh, it looks amazing. Ooh. It looks like a, a ton of fun to play, and I'm really excited about it. Uh, they I'll also look into it. they also released a Pikmin 4 trailer, which I'm excited for. I never played any Pikmin. Pikmin are super fun, super great games. Oh, oh. ooh. Ooh. Follow the pattern. Uh, <laughs> thought I had it. I thought I had the pattern. There you go. See, it's like this This is not a big dungeon. Like this No, is, this is very small. Which most of the dungeons in this game are. Um, probably the, the one that's probably the most difficult or most like convoluted would be the, uh, the Lost Woods in the Dark World. Um, it's a really good dungeon, but it, it can be confusing. But, you know, that's that's all. That, this, this isn't a huge game. You know, it's like it's, I've heard somebody argue that, well, Link to the Past had short dungeons. Like, yeah, but Link to the Past is how many years old compared to Tears of the Kingdom? And, like, I miss the Ocarina of Time, Majora's Mask, oh, scope of dungeons. Like, all that, that massive, like, several hour long things. You got the power glove. You can feel strength in both hands. You can pick up and carry stones now. So the white stones you can now pick up. Out in the overworld? Mm-hmm. Okay, well... Where have I not gone? The dark gray. Oh, on B... Or uh, the dark I gray. am in B1 right now? Yes, you were the little flashy light. Yeah. All right, well... Oh, gosh. Get me out. Get me out. Get me... Get... Grab the... <laughs> <laughs> uh, that was close. Yeah, I don't. I guess I haven't been down here yet. But like, I really love this uh, game. Like, this game. Kill it! Kill it! Kill it! Kill it! It's simple. It's straightforward. It's really well contained. It's it's great. Yeah, it, it's a fantastic Zelda game. It's not as fun as Tears of the Kingdom. <laughs> uh, but it it's very fun. Um, this way. Uh, 
well. What was out here? Nothing. Uh, actually, stuff. There's a heart piece down there, but that's fine. I'm not worried about it right now. <laughs> I'm assuming I have to do power glove stuff. Mm -hmm. So... Push the second from the right in that second. Yeah, that one. Push it. No. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I know one of those has to be pushed. Ooh. Is that grabbing both? No, you can't grab both. You need to push it, not pull it. Try the right side. Why isn't he shooting at me? Oh, right side. I see what you're saying. Why isn't he shooting at me? That's weird. Mm. Oh, yep, there it is. I knew it was coming eventually. What the heck? Mm. All right, head, head outside. Do I have to yeah, push head. it from the other side? Maybe. I don't remember. It's been forever since I played this game. Uh, are you pushing or are you holding? Like, just, just walk into it. Don't push it. There you go. Oh, I was holding A. Gotcha. Uh, you got Fairies. your net, right? Uh, you can catch a fairy now. That's a very easy catch. Yes. Is that the only bottle I've got? Uh, scroll over to the bottles. No, you got two. And fairies in this game. <laughs> what happened? You you used your bottle. <laughs> to oh <bring> no! <laughs> I'm I'm gonna. Oh, more. Whoops, even yeah. more. Okay, there you are. Uh, <sighs> cool. Keep it mm. in bottle. And, uh, uh, fairies will, will, if you die, the fairy will jump out and heal you like in other Zeldas. Just like in, just like in Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom. Yep. Where was the heart piece you said was out here? Go down. Don't jump off the edge. I will not. There it is. The one you saw earlier. Cool, cool, cool. I don't remember seeing that. You're giving me a lot of credit. <laughs> Eli, whenever you go back through and edit this, just rewind it real quick. Uh, go back outside. And explore uh, northward. Oh, this is this part of the dungeon up here? Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. That would make sense. Yay. Um, well, I say we call it here Well, the boss, halfway. you're almost to the boss. Like, you, you've got, like, three minutes. But, yeah, that's fine. We can we can save that for the next episode. Okay, we'll do that. Uh, well, thank y'all for joining us on this episode of uh, Link to the Past. Join us next time for more. And uh, like, comment, subscribe. See you guys later. Bye. <laughs>